today's video, we'll be showing you how students can upload and submit their work to Google Classroom Assignments. To get started, go to classroom.google.com on your laptop or Chromebook. If you are using an iPad, you may also use the Google Classroom app. Once you get into your classroom, you will be taken to your stream. Your stream will have posts, assignments, comments from both your teacher and possibly students in your classroom. The easiest way to navigate to your assignments is under the Classwork tab. Once you have clicked here, you will find all of your assignments. Notice they will have due dates as well. Today we will be exploring first how to submit an assignment with an attachment. If you click on the assignment, it will show you a drop down option. Notice here I have a Google Docs attached that begins with my name. No matter the format, it will always start with the copy of whatever your teacher has assigned you with your name first. If you click View Assignment, you can see more information. Once you click here, you will be able to see where you can leave a class comment. Remember, these are public, so all students in your class can see these. This would be a great place to add a question that might benefit others in your classroom. You can also see that same doc we talked about previously. Here you will see the Add button. We will talk about this a little bit more on assignments with no attachments. Here's a Turn In button. And then also notice Private Comment Options. This is for something you only want your teacher to see. I can also click here to get to my doc. And if my teacher has provided me with a template, I can start editing and submitting my assignment here. Once I have finished my submission, I can click Turn In in the top right hand corner. Once you do this, you will lose all editing rights and the teacher will take them over. So you do not want to hit this button until you are ready and completely finished. If you are not finished, you can simply exit out of your doc. Clicking back here will take you back to your progress so that you can continue working on your assignment. You can also click the Turn In button here. After you have submitted your assignment, you can navigate back to your class in the top left hand corner. Here I can go back to classwork and see my other assignments. Notice it now says that this assignment is turned in. Let's explore assignments with no, atta with no attachments. If I click View Assignment, you will notice I do not have that document with my name. However, I can click this plus Add or Create to add my own files. Under the Google Drive option, you can add any file in your Google Drive. For example, this could be a Google Doc you have created or it might be a video file that you have uploaded and stored in your Google Drive. Notice the other types of files you can attach. You have the option for links. Files on a laptop will take you to any document stored on your hard drive, such as a Microsoft Word file. If you are uploading from an iPad, it could take you to your camera roll or your files. If you have not started the document or assignment, you can use blank docs, slides, sheets, and drawings from below. They will automatically be stored in your Google Drive and work the same way. From here you have the same options for commenting or private messaging or submitting. If you are uploading from an iPad, please note that a lot of the same functions will be listed at the bottom of your screen instead of to the left-hand menu that you are seeing or the top that you are noting here. 